Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to that's the Kaiserreich Legacy of with the host Rumx. <clears throat> and here we have our mighty conflicts with the Chinese Empire, culminating in the Great Offensive upon Mongolia. See we have the Confederation of Great Lakes Forces. No. Uh, in Guangzhou, the Koreans are kicking ridiculous amounts of ass, which is amazing. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so proud of the Koreans. Uh, let's see, United States, I'm just trying to remember what we were. Confederation, the UP is doing well. Never to our lands. Oh well, yes, we have our colonies here. You know, Mali, Morocco, Hashemite Arabia, Pan-Arabic Federation, Jordan controls Jerusalem, Syria is its thing. Everyone is looking really good. We have Hellenic forces holding out in Persia. We have a couple army groups there, and let's actually let's actually put everything. Which is exactly what we're doing, but I want to make sure you know because we really, really, really upgrade our, our, our just everything. I mean, yeah. is there any way I can produce I can produce loads of equipment? Yes. All right, we're social democratic, labor, social liberal actually. Labor Party is in power. We're in Mongolia, we're marching forward with great fury. Pretty soon we're going to consolidate our alliance, so let's get back to the game. The South is holding out very well. In fact, we've even made some gains. Let's go. Text them. Time to a bomber. We need to get an aerial superiority. So let's... This is actually interesting, 1950s though. We should actually go for this. Air cavalry. Yeah. It's 1955, 1950, Night vision tactics. Let's do it. Who has this goes for this? We're going from Wiggles. And let's go. It's been a while since I recorded, so I'm actually going to uh, pause here and ch uncheck the. I'm actually going to. Wait, what am I. Yeah, right. I'm actually going to pause here and check my. Um, my body my body hall. So, you're back. And I'm back. Hopefully, it sounds better. Uh, if it doesn't, <laughs> I apologize. Right, so we have our Army Corps making it here. Panzer Divisions absolutely crushing. The inferior Qing forces, inferior in uh, in technology, not really. No, they're putting up a good fight, really. Let's go. All right, so everything's looking real good. My chair is still very loud, and it's even broken more. So, za. Here then here. Let's move a couple groups down here and then here. These are mechanized infantry, 1948. Let's move it there, there. Actually, let's split up. I want those guys to go there, and I want a small task force to go south. These guys just move up to Lion Joe. While we wait for more troops to come in, we're gonna have these guys hold out and have our coalition forces march to the far east. Well, Siberia and stuff. But the um, the Russians and the Koreans are doing amazing, so we really don't need to worry about this. And we also have the mighty Uzbekistan. <laughs> Let's see, Uzbekistan actually has cores on Turkmenistan. Let's see, and Kazakhstan has their natural core and actual stuff. And Kyrgyzstan is fine, so yeah, we don't need to worry about anything really. Actually, whatever this place is belongs somewhere. I don't know where, but we'll see. Alright, let's go. 
The Ching are offering peace, but there will be no peace. Hey, semi-modern battleship. Interesting. Let's go back to aircraft. I mean, uh, naval. Let's get some modern carriers. Perfect. Friedrich Krupker, Germania Wharf. Germania Wharf. Whoa! Diplomatic deals. Beautiful. Uh, I just traded something with Canada. Uh, right now, Mauser just finished, I believe, 1946 Cavalry, which was... Yeah, they just finished the last thing. So now we can go for 45 uh, motorized and 52 mechanized. Let's go down. Yeah, let's go down. Actually, let's go for 51 infantry. We can use it. Hey, interracial. That's cool. How's this doing? Crushed. Oh, that's a. Oh, that's a. That's unfortunate. It's a poor HQ. Interesting. Okay, there goes turbojet. Alright, aircraft. Let's go for turbojet fighter. Perfect. We got Windsors and both thrones. <laughs> Iceland is a glorious puppet. Scandinavia has remained ridiculously untouched, but I don't really have any plans for them. I mean, they can stay doing their own thing. Really. 298. Oh, we dwarf the shit out of them. That's a damn sure. Our largest, our strongest vassal would probably be the Russians. They're they're at 298 right now. Apparently. <laughs> okay. So not only have we brought back Dmitry Romanov from the dead, we've also apparently brought back Cyril Romanov. All right, yeah, let's. Uh, mhm. Mm let's not. Let's let's uh, drop that. Yeah. Yeah, that didn't happen. <laughs> oh man, this game is so fucked right now. In fact, I believe we can literally just destroy the Chinese right now. As soon as these guys catch up, we're gonna split up. Okay. Panzer divisions, reserve divisions. All right, let's let's split a bit. Let's send these seven divisions down here. Here, seize Chengdu. Let's, get here. Let's send this elite core down to seize one Shan. All right. Let's send this seven to go to Tianshui, then Hong Kong. Let's have these guys go here to go to Xi'an. Let's have these guys, 1945 infantry, going to Yichuan, go there, into Ping Liang, go there, down, Ping Liang. We have this Mongolian force, let's go here, and actually just stay there. In fact, let's split up, six divisions, go to Huehua, Huehua Ti. Coalition forces are pushing through, destroying them. The Koreans are holding the Manchurian front. Looks like with a lot of coalition forces. Portuguese, Galician, Flanders, Wallonian forces. The Confederations of Great Lakes are still being badasses. Oh man, yeah. Advanced cent centimetric radar warning sites. Okay, let's go back to industrial. We still have eight nukes, so we could go for that. But then we could also go for info through right now. That's a bit too far ahead. Let's go for construction. Go. Kingdom to Sicilies. Everyone's doing fine. Oh man. Crushed, son. Crushed. Pardon me. Uh oh. Oh, it's sudden day. Celebration. Alright. We may need a southern force to go down and catch these guys off. Actually, I do have a southern force going. Let's go further into Xinjiang. And then from there, we'll split off and we'll start bringing these troops down here up into a southern push to help the uh, Great Lakes Confederation. 
lost actually in New England, so we also lost again. Let's see, these are New England and uh, Great Confederation Great Lakes do great. Two thousand seven hundred and forty manpower, man. Regaining Wow, we're getting two manpower a day. How are we doing in terms of nineteen percent of our forces? Uh, yeah. As soon as the coalition forces in the north break out. It's gonna be a hard fight to get, you know. See, we're losing in certain places. And we, yeah, this marine, this marine got its ass handed to it, unfortunately. As soon as our forces can call it, consolidate along these fronts, we can easily just break through. In fact, I'm gonna, I'm gonna actually move these infantry divisions over to Xi'an. Let's move these guys over here. Move these guys down here. Fifty-two. Night vision tactics is done. Hammer of the gods. Modern spearhead. Two years ahead. Let's go for semi-modern hospital. We can do with the. Uh, Trickle back modifier. Okay, we lost in high air. I see that. All right, we got put, we got pushed back into Russia. How are we doing on the reinforcements front? Really good. Yeah. Okay. In fact, we're wasting a bit of see in there, but that's 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 understandable. Hmm. The Japs still have minor colonies. I don't know how I feel about that. I, know, I guess I can live with it. Protection chain. Yeah, you go too. Yeah, these guys got in here. Let's wait a bit for their. If we can split up. Yeah, if we could split up um, North China and South China, we might be able to just crush them. But then again, all their forces could be in the north, so this could just be like nothing. Like, this could like not even be a thing. Main battle tanks, tank destroyers, and we need that. We could go for self-propelled, but it's really not necessary. That's we could go naval, but we could go for naval doc doctrines. We haven't gone for these in a while. Do we really need this though? I would say she'd more go for. Yeah. Strategic missiles, hel helicopter, airborne assaults. Yes. Vietnam style. Heinz Guderian. Get on that shit. You know, offensive air superiority would not be that bad. No, let's go for that. Who do we have for it? Uh, Adolf Galant, Manfred, the Red Baron. Oh, uh oh, We're getting ourselves into a little pocket here. This isn't good. All right, you there? Break down that way. Everyone else, it's time to go. All right, let's have these tanks go. Crush through Liu Yang to Zhengzhou. These guys just go to Liu Yang. These guys hold in Tongguan. Let's have the paratroopers go through to Kaifeng. I want you to go. Yeah, then Kaifeng. Okay, perfect. Oh, yeah, this is, this is going to be good. Panzer divisions and infantry go southwards. Break up. Go into Heifei. Yeah. You guys just going to Anqing. You guys go down into Yinchang. You guys go down into Wuhan. You guys, I want you to be in Hezi. Alright, you 
you guys go down to Shashi. You guys go down to Chengdi. Yeah, this is gonna be good. Down this way, this way, this way. Right here. Oh god. Oh, great. Alright, it's fine. Let's go with Changsha. And go. I don't know, it seems like all of the enemies are like up north. More diplomatic deals. Nice. Oh. Wait, Ceylon has the troops now? I mean, well, Sri Lanka. Whoa, they have six cores already. No ships yet. They probably have that dumb AI that doesn't build ships like England and Scotland and Wales. It's kind of dumb. Pardon me. <clears throat> yes, crush them in Yemen. Turbojet fighter. Nope. No peace. Let's go for Junkers. Fog Wolf. Go multi roll. Gotha. Go. Interesting. We really have no air force to speak of. Yeah, there's no one there. We have five divisions down there. That's nothing. Panzer Grenadiers. Crushed. Super carrier. Why don't we build one of them? CV, CV, CV. Brandenburg class super carrier. CV 8. We carry groups anti air radar and improved hull. It's going to take three years to develop. The game will be over by the time we get this thing. We can commission four to make it worth our while. Let's do it. Graf Zeppelin, Peter Strasser, Hugo Eckner, and Paul Heinlein. <clears throat> wow, the Qing really didn't put up that much of a fight. I mean, they did early on. They really did put up a really good fight early on, but... Alright, we lost. We lost some troops. Although we're getting... We're getting garrison with allies, like, almost immediately. Alright. Time to go up. Boom. Yeah, that's gonna be good. That is gonna be so good. Go! And we got something new. Offensive air superiority. Yes. Air doctrines. Fighter focus. That's where we're gonna do the Japs. They're gonna be our final enemy. <laughs> as soon as we crush our our obvious ideological enemy in the Partia Commune, the final commune of socialism in the world. It's kinda hypocritical of us, but whatever, man. We're Germany, we don't give a fuck. They're destroying our business interests. There we go. Also, I have not released Persia yet, which is kinda wait, is it because Persia's actually Yeah, they are. I'll wait till I annex the key the chain. This is like reverse Japanese invasion of China. We hold the interior, they hold the exterior. <laughs> then again, I probably just sounded extremely ignorant. Wow, good job.
you're so close to cutting them off. Honestly, our army groups are probably spreading themselves kind of thinly. Just crush them. Panzer Divisions. Perfect. It sees the coast from them. They won't be able to cover from that. Just utter destruction. In fact, this pocket is kind of annoying me. Let's go there to Hefei and go to Nantong. Nantong or war! As soon as we cut them off here. Ooh, it's fair game, man. Fair game. Yes. Oh, we cut them off. We cut them off. We cut them off. Semi-modern hospital system is done. It's always good. Let's see. We could continue our naval advance, but I'm really starting to get really interested in air. We gotta upgrade our carrier air groups as well. We have to do this. We could have the Zeppelin Corporation do it, but at the same time, Albatross Flug's work sounds so much cooler. Um, pretty soon we could probably go for the main battle tank, or we can always, you know, we can always go for the new modern car, but that's way ahead of it. Our flak is ridiculously underpowered. Just spam, spam to flak. Rhine metal. So we just got, we just got uh, pre-planned air operations. It sounds interesting. Oh man, this air, this this, I I'm a, I'm a, I'm just imagining an amazing airborne assault with Japan right now. Holy shit. Just, oh my god, just, just Vietnam style. Hueys, well, uh, I wonder what our, her oh no, what our aircraft are, I mean, our things are called. I believe if I were to make it, yeah, airborne cavalry, I think it would say. I'm not sure. Advanced modern armor. That's like tank, mechanized infantry. Motorized armored airborne. Maybe an air wing? We do have the albatross. Oh man, we can make so much cool shit. But first we have to upgrade our our, our modern troops. We just lost we just lost Xiao Guan to someone. Man, they're pushing us back. Also, I should probably declare war on the legation city. Shouldn't oh I just realized it. Actually they're gonna supply it, never mind. That would have sucked. You go there, and then there, and there. You guys just brain destruction along the coast. Also declare war on these guys. Boom, boom, finally boom, boom, boom. Yes. You guys go here, 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 here. Whoa. Nanping. Lost in Dibao. Well, we officially split China up. up. They have no navy to speak of, which means they can't do shit. We just kick their ass and just go on. These guys are doing exceptionally well. Let's break them there. 
and then the final pieces of the puzzle in the south are being filled. Oh, Guangzhou, wow. We only lost a thousand. We're losing significantly less casualties as we go along in this war. Well, as we go along in tech, I should say. Also, we're almost... Oh my god, Beijing's in our reach. We should just seize it right now. Okay. Hold, hold, hold. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more victory points to seize. We can do this right now. There, there, and there. Let's just charge straight on through. Right into Qingdi. You go there. We'll have everyone here just destroy up to there. More advanced modern armors. Do I have any northern troops? Let's go over here. We need Qingdao. We just got new Antier. In a couple days, actually. Pretty soon we'll have Sam missile sites. air missiles close the gap on them carrier air group ah oh, pretty soon we can get the, the latest CAS the latest the latest carrier well latest air blah sorry uh, let's go for the carrier air group yeah. We have Beijing, the Forbidden Cities, in our hands. The Chinese are just gonna surrender soon. If there's an event for it, I can feel it. You go this way. And this way. You guys go this way. And this way. You go to Shanghai. You go this way. I do believe that. Yep, it's the last victory point. The Chinese are on the run now. Won't be long until they surrender. Nope. Just close the hammer. Well, the trap. Close it. Destroy them. Pretty soon the siege of Shanghai will be over. We have more tech. I believe that was turbojet fighter. Multi roll 1954. All right, let's go for modern air transports. Oh man. Two USN fleets. There goes the legation cities. What? Oh, whatever. Wait, what? I do, don't I? Yeah, I do. Why can't I annex? Oh! Because of Hong Kong, of course. Belongs to the... Wait, no. The clip comes to the legation cities. Wait, what? Where else is their victory points that they... Oh! Omsk. Kingdom of two. What? That makes no sense. Give me your army. Give me your army. You fucking sicken me. That's basic armor division. Ouch. Well, level 5 armored. Oh, reserve panzer division just upgraded to advanced armor. Advanced armor, advanced armor. Pre planned. Air is done. Let's go to land auctions. You know what, let's go for Modern Spearhead. Manfred is done with Rapid Air Superiority. Interesting. Hmm. 
Yeah. Let's go for that. We're gonna need the naval bombers to destroy the Japs. Go. We just researched something too. Okay, that was a uh, a tier. A brigades. They regain Omsk. They did. So victory. Oh, and these legations. Well, actually, the legations must be dealt with now. Charge! Destroy Macau. The siege of Macau has begun. A couple days so far. They've lasted 1921-1942. We have 1944 airborne divisions, man. The Reichswehr army is unstoppable. By the way, I learned that it's not... It is not the Wehrmacht, it is the Reichswehr. The Wehrmacht was like, uh... Under the Third Reich. Or the Weimar Republic. I believe it was just the Third Reich, though. The army was called, um... Oh, that's... Those are weird borders. Let me deal with these real fast. I'll be right back.